go to the lines. Let's go and speak to Ed, who's a Man United fan. It's Dargo 37172 Ed? Hello. All right, Ed. Has anybody seen <laughs> Roman Abramovich? <laughs> Has anybody seen Chopper Harris? <laughs> Oh, yes, that's right. Yeah, I do remember that. They did. They won the transfer window. <laughs> they did. And he was complaining, saying that we haven't got the right transfer. <laughs> I, do, I do remember that. You're absolutely, you're absolutely. All right. I'm, I'm all gonna, right, I'm, mate, I'm gonna, all right. Top man. I, I, I was just going to say one, one quick thing. Go on. Yeah, one quick thing. Go on. I'm just thinking, I'm not saying we're going to get the title or whatever, but... I'm just glad. I, I said it at the start because remember, Jace, um, Jamie said to me, "Oh, what has Ten Hag done? He's only done it in in thing." And I was very supportive at that time. So I'm not. So I know Jermaine likes to say, "Ah, oh, you United supporters get carried away." I'm not getting carried away, but I said that I trust in Ten Hag, and I'm just. I just want. I just want to say what a good job he's done. I can't. It's more than my wildest dreams. Just even just to be in the talk yeah. for the title is big. I tell you when that was. I've just found. I've just yeah. one second. I've just found it. It yeah. was Saturday the thirteenth yeah. of August. Um, yeah. You got, you got. But it looks like you might have been the, the, the late kickoff. Uh, yeah. But yeah, uh, yeah. I'm pretty. Sh- yeah, he was. He was still in charge. Um, okay. Tuchel. Tuchel was okay, still in charge. So, 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 it, so it's 
So what are you saying, Jason? You, you then made a different prediction. All I'm saying is, all I'm saying is, we had a different manager then. So all I'm saying, Ned, all right? Ed, top man, appreciate the call, bud. Cheers, mate. Cheers, mate. Cheers. He's only thrown in Crazy Larry. Do you, do you, do you know Crazy Larry's? No. What's Crazy? Right, just off the King's Road. No. No? Yeah, well, you, you, oh, you've probably been there. You've probably been there at some stage, Jam. Is it, is it a different name now? No, it's, it's I think the same I'm, name. I'm pretty sure. I'm pr pretty sure it's still there. Um, if it's not, name. someone tell us. Oh three seven one seven double two double three double four. Let's go another call. Let's go and speak to. Where should we go? Let's go and speak to Ali. Let's go and speak to Ali. Ali, the main night fan. Good evening. Good evening, guys. Good evening, Ali. Ali. Right, Ali. I don't think I can. Uh, I don't think I can follow that last caller. No, but, um, no. Do you want to try? Um, Ali, but do, think, you want, do you want to? Has think, anyone yeah. seen? No, no, no. no. I'm, I'm Ali, come on, don't bottle it. I'm not, I'm not doing rehearsal. I, I'll leave. I'll, I'll, I'll pass on that. Right, but I was going to say, I think, I think all United fans everybody need to calm down, calm down a little bit. Ooh. We haven't won anything yet. We haven't won anything yet. We could next three games. We could lose to Barcelona. We could um, lose to Newcastle and then lose to West Ham. We've got next three games for Liverpool. So oh, you I mean, don't want to get carried away. No, no, you just don't want to get carried away. But you're on some great form, though, Ali. You're great, great form. I think at the moment you're probably the the, the best form in, in, in you know in Europe and in the league. Um, you're probably the only yeah. team now that can really challenge Man City and Arsenal for, for the race. title. It's a free horse race now. You know, football. You know, football. Things can change within a. I just don't want to get carried away. Let's beat Barcelona first. Let's do the cup final first, and I'll just be happy with just just a win of the cup final. Um, I've just rang up to talk about Potter, actually. Um, even though I'm a United fan, I really wanted Potter to do well. Um, he was one of the first English managers to have a shot at one of the big clubs. Um, and I really wanted him to do well. I just want to know, what, what's wrong with English managers? Gerard, Lampard, they don't seem to be, um, you know, is this an English manager thing um, that they just can't hack it? I don't know, what, what, what is it? Um, is I mean, this when... English manager won. Listen, being at these these big teams where you've not got that pedigree, it's very difficult. It, it, you, you know, it's just it's just the nature of the beast. But what I feel for Potter is that Bowley's made these signings and they're kind of his players or, and, and his yeah. visions. Yeah. And when you're a manager, you have your own style. So you pick yeah. players individually for your style that you set up. Like when, when yeah. Klopp came in, he bought Mane because he likes closing down from the front and he's one of the best at doing that. So Klopp built a team... You know, a, a new team with these players in mind, his vision. Potter's not really got that, so he's having to make do with mm. just players. Yes, good players, but are they right for his kind of style? So I do feel for Potter. Can I just on the back of that? Can I just on the back of that? Sorry, sorry. Paul Wynn yeah. Stanley was brought in from Brighton. That was a relationship he had with Potter yeah. that went out, and I'm pretty sure he was he was responsible for Trossard, Gross, mm. McAllister, def, definitely. Um, plenty of other players so I think the reason he's been brought in is so that relationship is there is joined up thinking between Win Stanley and Graham Potter yeah. it's still in its infancy but mm. that's thought I'd just make that point can, can I just say I don't think these big money signing, signings have helped and look at Eddie Howe even though they've got a lot of money they've been very clever in the transfer market. they've not gone for big big signings haven't they um, so I think the big money signings haven't helped but they've put him under immense pressure unfortunately uh, and that's 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 also been a, a reason one thing why I will I say is that the window only shut three, three weeks ago three weeks you know that yeah. it's not it, 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 that, that's when the players signed in, in January we, we're only at the 20th of Feb do you know what I mean? It's, it's not like he's had those players to coach them and work with them. That's, that's, exactly. that's I, I been think, the problem. I think he needs more time. He needs to spend more time with them. Just one question, uh, Jason. When do you think we'll ever see an English manager win the league in the next few years? Um, well, I mean, I can't, I can't see past... Well, in the three, the three right now that you're looking at, or the four... You, Klopp, you, Ten Hag and, and... Yeah, yeah, and, and Arteta's Pep. at the top as well, right? And Arteta, that was four. I mean, you, yeah. can't, you can't see I, past no. those right now, can you? No. Who's that? Hello. I'll put, I'll, I'll put a name in there. Oh, who's that, Ali? Who's Hello. on the phone? <laughs> I, I think. Um, it's, I think. Um, who's it? Who's it? Somebody's going to do a quack. quack thing for, Go on. for Chelsea. Go on. <laughs> I can't do that. Go on. No, I'm just going to say I'm going to put. I'm going to put Michael Carrick in the hat in the next few years. I'm okay. Carrick as well. Yeah, I mean, it's, listen. Thanks. I thought he was going to do a quack. You going to do a quack, Ali, or not? No, nope, not tonight. Go on. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> thanks for the call, Ali. Cheers, mate. Thanks. Good call. Cool. There he is, Ali. Come on, do a quack. Oh three seven one seven double two double three double four. He's doing very well, Carrick. Well, he's doing. So he's taken them from the brink of, of of relegation to the brink of promotion. 
In, in, in what's Pernin. it been? There what's was it a, been? There was at one stage where Bright, um, Burnley and Sheffield United were flying Absolutely as a, like, yeah. 15, well, Burnley, 20 I points. think Burnley are home and home. Yeah, yeah, they are. But now, yes. Middlesbrough are only five points off Sheffield United well, for they second beat, spot. They them, didn't they? Did they for down? second spot. At one stage, I look at that league and I'm like, oh, yeah, well, there's the two teams promoted. Carrick is absolutely ripping what up. A, in, what yeah, a job yeah, he's doing. Yeah, yeah. And any other, if you want to mention any other young English managers that are doing well, uh, maybe not in this country, maybe maybe abroad, that you'd like to give a, a shout-out to. The problem that English managers have had historically is that they they, they get, look, Gerard done very well at, at Rangers. You can't, can't deny that. Yeah. You know, he split, he stopped Celtic getting the 10th, getting the, the, the the right? 10th so, in the row. So, it, tenth so, in the row. Yeah, yeah, so, so, so he did well there. Then there's a, it's a different, but it also it feels as though do, do they cut their teeth early enough? I mean, Carrick's gone down to the to, to, to Middlesbrough. Mm. He's doing a remarkable. Clearly, he's, he's got doing doing things right. Mm. You know, he's had a, maybe an education at Manchester United on yeah. the on the touchline there as well. Maybe that maybe that's yeah. helped. But they do get big jobs early, don't they? Yeah. And I think sometimes you it's better to, to, to stay in where you're at to, well, to learn. Pip's come up the ranks. It's not like he's got that job straight away. No, Jeremy, yeah, yeah, started off in in some low league in the mid in. Mm. The Midlands, I think and to be fair, at Brighton he deserved it from what he was doing to Brighton, get him to where they were. He did deserve yeah. a, a, a big team. He was doing well at Brighton. The Sports Bar with Jamie O'Hara and Jason Cundy, Monday to Thursday nights from ten on AM on DAB via the Talk Sport app and on your smart speaker. Talk Sport.